From the shopping channel that brought you the Severus Snape School of Speech and Deportment comes the collected wisdom of Albus Percival Wolfric Brian Dumbledore in 15 handsome leather-bound volumes with extensive annotations by the respected editor Ovidian Vellum. This is the only authorised publication of Dumbledore's work, having had considerable lively input from his portrait. Open the first volume, Principles of Educational Theory, to the chapter title, Innovation is Overrated, and it's as though you're sitting in Dumbledore's office, having an intimate conversation with the man himself. Is there something you wish to tell me? No, sir. Nothing. Very well then. Off you go. Is there something you wish to tell me? No, sir. Nothing. Very well then. Off you go. Help will always be given at Hogwarts. To those who ask for it. Help will always be given at Hogwarts, Harry, to those who ask for it. Volume 2, Making Decisions, examines in detail the quality of the choices Dumbledore made as headmaster at Hogwarts. There won't be a child in our world who doesn't know his name. Exactly. He's far better off growing up away from all of that. <laughs> sufficient evidence to have you both expelled? Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Therefore, it is only fitting that you both receive special awards for services to the school. I have no intention of going to Azkaban. Enough of this. Take him! We've agreed. Reward him second place. Yes! yes. Second place. For outstanding moral fiber. Silence! Everyone will please not panic. The Chamber of Secrets has indeed been opened again. Our students are in great danger. I strongly recommend caution. Wall. Dark forces attempt to penetrate this castle's walls. But in the end, their greatest weapon is you. Just something to think about. Now, off to bed. Pip pip. It's him, Headmaster. He's here! Somewhere in the castle! Serious Black! <laughs> Secure the castle, Mr. Jones. The rest of you, in the Great Hall. Volume 3, The Man Himself takes us inside the mind and habits of the greatest wizard of his time. That is one of my more brilliant ideas. And between you and me, that is saying something. I am well aware of our bylaws, Severus, having written quite a few of them myself. Well, being me has its privileges. Ah, Bertie Botts, every flavor beans. You put your name in a couple of the fire. No, sir. You ask one of the older students to do it for you? No, sir. You're absolutely sure? Yes, yes sir. You see, Harry, I've searched and searched for something. Some small detail. Every time I get close to an answer, it slips away. That's maddening. What do you suggest, Minerva? 
put an end to it. Don't let Potter compete. You heard Barty, the rules are clear. Good day, champions. Gather round, please. Now, you've waited, you've wondered, and at last the moment has arrived, a moment only four of you can fully appreciate. What are you doing here, Miss Granger? Oh, Harry, do feel free to indulge in a little liquor snap in my absence, but I have to warn you, they're a wee bit sharp. Ah. Meanwhile, I'd like a nice cup of tea or a large brandy. This appears to be a gift, Horace. You don't remember who gave you this bottle. Which, by the way, possesses remarkably subtle hints of licorice and cherry. Well, I'm like you, Tom. I'm different. Well? He's free. We did it. Did what? Good night. Mm -hmm. A child's voice, however honest and true, is meaningless oh. to those who've forgotten how to listen. I never liked these curtains. Set them on fire in my fourth year. By accident, of course. If I take this, I do love knitting patterns. to be young and to feel love's keen sting. I fear I may have stolen a wondrous night from you, Harry. She was, truthfully, very pretty, the girl. It's all right, sir. What about your activities outside the classroom? Sir? Well, I notice you spend a great deal of time with Miss Granger. I can't help wondering if... Oh, no, no. I mean, she's brilliant and we're friends, but no. Forgive me. I was really being curious. Volume 4, Mentoring the Chosen One, gives us a unique insight into the delicate task of nurturing a very special young man through adolescence. Percy, I've never had much time for heroes. Professor. 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 Voldemort has the Elder Wand. True. And the snake's still alive. Yes. And I've nothing to kill it with. Professor, what shall I do? Professor. Volume 5. Pearls of Wisdom brings together some of Albus Dumbledore's truly inspiring moments. For in dreams we enter a world that's entirely our own. Let them swim in the deepest ocean or glide over the highest cloud. We've taken the briefest of looks at the first five volumes in this magnificent collection. Imagine owning all 15 volumes your library would be the envy of everyone. But don't take my word for it. Ask the man himself if this isn't the most exciting publication available today. Well, maybe later.